Welcome back to Dude Ranch DIY. My name is Jake, and as you saw, I just took a nice big dump of some mostly barkless, standing dead RTB sugar maple, or rock maple, or hard maple, if you will. Um, this is all from a job that I did yesterday. Did not film it because it was a larger job, and we had a couple little issues going on with chippers, but uh, got it all figured out. It was a new client. So I wanted to give my, my best first impression. And I think we did just that. They were super happy. We did two removals that were like this stone dead, um, as well as a bunch of pruning. We had the bucket truck there on site. Joe and Chris were absolutely amazing as per usual. I'm really lucky to have those guys. And uh, yeah, this is the wood that we brought home. I brought a load of some other stuff to another gentleman that I often, you know, once or twice a year dump logs at and he, you know, splits it up for firewood or whatever. I don't charge him. I, I just look for a spot to get rid of the wood and uh, that's how it works out. So just got it here in the wood yard. We're gonna work on this a little bit later, but for now we're going to take the international truck, hook it back up to the big Morabar chipper. We're gonna head over to my buddy Justin's house. Justin is a good friend that uh, we met here once we moved into town and uh, he borrowed one of my chainsaws a couple weeks ago. Uh, he said he had a bunch of like little saplings and stuff he wanted to cut down in his backyard. So I let him do that. Also gave him a pair of chaps. Uh, he has all of his limbs still, at least I think. <laughs> and uh, we're gonna go over and just help him suck some of this brush through. And then I think he's gonna come back with me and we're gonna spend the afternoon over here splitting some wood and stuff. He's, he's expressed interest in wanting to learn how to split wood and just like kind of see the whole operation. He's seen, been in the wood yard and hung out during our bonfires and everything when we're not doing any production, but I think he wants to uh, check out what splitting all the wood and everything is like. So we'll give him a little taste of that. So it should be a good afternoon. It's supposed to rain later today. It's a pretty cloudy overcast day, but it is like in the low 60s. We just sold three bundles of firewood, so that's good. Uh, enough chit chat, let's get going. All right guys, this is Justin. We are here at his house. Got the chipper and everything set up, got the tarp on. You did some work over here, huh buddy? Sure did, it got busy with the chainsaw this past week. Yeah, it's amazing what you do when you have a, a chainsaw in your hand, right? Oh yeah. There's no stopping. No stopping, I'm so, still ready to go. <laughs> so we got all this stuff here to chip up. It's a big rat's nest of shit. And oh, stuff. And then uh, we got all, it looks like all hemlock and stuff over there, so. We're gonna throw you guys on a time lapse, speed this up, and uh, get her done. How was that? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Best job you've ever had? Best in the world. <laughs> Best in the world. Yeah, we got uh, got a good amount of chips there, maybe like a third of a can. Uh, what'd you learn for next time about brush arrangement? Ass out, or bottom out. Bottom out. Bottom out. Yeah, all, all the butts yeah. facing in the same direction make yeah, it a lot that, easier. That was a miss. Yeah, no, that's all, you know, gotta start somewhere, so. That was good. I bet that feels good to get that all cleaned up. Got some more chips to dump in the wood yard. Uh, unless you want them. You don't no, want them, right? They're all for you. They're all for me. Great. Thanks. Um, <laughs> so yeah, that's going to be it for here. Now what's the plan? You're going to come back to the wood yard and we're going to, we're going to make big wood into small wood. Let's do it. All right. We'll see you back at the wood yard. Yeah. 
Okay, guys, we got a little fire going here in the oil drum fire barrel thing. Justin is here, wardrobe change, but we have gotten the dump trailer aligned back underneath the conveyor. And basically what we got here is some ash rounds that were uh, still cut up from when Chris and I did that splitting session in the, I think it was the last video. Um, so we're just going to split these up quick. Justin is uh, pretty green when it comes to about splitting as green firewood. As can be. Yeah, about as green as we can get. So he's gonna he's gonna check out this whole process. Um, we're just gonna split up this little bit of ash into the dump trailer, and then I'll stack it up into a tote because I just moved all that maple that I dumped in the beginning of the video onto the you know wood pile. So we'll do all this maple and all that maple next. Chris and I probably at some point this week and get rid of all that and then we'll, we'll be back to all the ash so um plan now is to fire up the rugged made splitter and the conveyor and uh make a little bit of firewood while teaching justin the the ins and outs of uh processing firewood long time subscriber first time visitor here yeah really for <laughs> he's big. a very loyal subscriber very important <laughs>
Well guys, we had a good run there. We've had a good run for the past couple videos, but the chain on the right there hopped off the sprocket. So I gotta break the chain, put it back on the sprocket. We should be back up and running in a couple minutes. Justin, what do you think so far? Unbelievable. You like it? Unbelievable. Do it all day. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. We'll find out. Best job you ever had? Best in the world. <laughs> Best place in the world. Heaven on Earth. West Virginia. Justin, first time in the wood yard, first time. Have you split wood before? Never in my life. You've never split wood before? Nope. Not with a log splitter, not with an ax, nothing? Nothing at all. All right, so this was your first time splitting wood on what I'd consider to be a, you know, a, a, a decent machine. It's, you know, middle of the road. Uh, it's got some nice features on it. We definitely got a conveyor going over here. That was pretty nice, pretty nice ash wood. What'd you think? Never appreciated wood more than I do right now. <laughs> Appreciation's real. This thing purrs. It's a nice little process here. Good process. You like it's it's kind of gratifying. It's fantastic. Right? Makes a Sunday, it's a Sunday, make, makes a Sunday a lot a lot better than it could have been. Well, come and check out, you know, what what's in the trailer. You you didn't you didn't see sure. the fruits of your labor here. Uh, we'll sh we'll show everybody what you did. So there you go. Nice, nice little pile. How much do you think that is? That's probably a, a solid, you know, small tote full. Um, what Chris and I have been doing actually is we got a tote here of all, you can see it's all pretty small, uniform pieces, no bark. It's all barkless. So we're wow. separating out the centers. That's all going to be for bundles. Mm. And then over here we have kindling that we've been separating out, you know, all the little pieces. And then behind it, we got a tote of all, you know, bulk yeah. firewood with the bark. So... 
you know, th that's what we're kind of trying to do. S separate out the nicer stuff without, without the bark for bundles, nice square pieces. And, uh, you know, that way we can charge a premium for that. That's how you run a business. Well, that's what we're trying to do here. Work smart, you know? not hard. Exactly. Work smarter, not harder. So anyway, guys, that's pretty much going to wrap up this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, let me know if you liked Justin on the channel here. I, I think he, uh, he's going to be featured in some more videos. Hopefully we, we might do some more stuff with him. He just lives like five minutes down the road. He's here in the wood yard quite often, but we're just never working. We're That's always true. drinking in always, the wood yard, which, which I think it's, it's probably about time for a banquet right now. 100%. What do you think? Yeah. So Deserved. earned, yeah, earned. earned, earned a banquet. Earned. So, um, that's going to be it for this one. As always guys, thanks so much for watching. Um, if you like this stuff, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't done so already, click that subscribe button down below. Questions, comments, or feedback, throw it down in that comment section. But for now, I'm Jake. Justin. This is Dude Ranch DIY. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you here next time.